Hello, YouTube. Okay, so I am here in my home. And I just got back from Costco and I thought I would show you what I buy when I go to Costco as a single individual who only eats so much food. Um, I have a lot of basic stuff that I'm going to be either freezing or adding to my meal plan. So, here we go. I don't know how to lift this, but egg whites, cage-free, power greens. Woo! Um, this is charred kale, spinach, pre-washed. So this you can put in the freezer or, hey, can you not? Okay, sorry, the dogs were barking. All right, back to it. Cucumbers, these are organic. Cukes, how cute is that? Cukes, love it. These will be an awesome like snack. I've been feeling really hungry from having lower, um, calories that I'm used to. So I think that's making me hungry because my body wants more food. Makes sense. Uh, so I'm gonna start eating more cucumber when I'm feeling like friggin' hungry um, before a meal because I notice if I feel super, super hungry and I'm eating, I really am really bummed out when my meal is over because I want more food per usual. So hopefully those will help. I also got this bag of organic squash because I love zucchini. And I've never had yellow zucchini squash, but we're gonna give it a try, why not? And um, this is a fun little pickup, the Quaker Oats Flavor Variety Oats, because um, I, have these, I have these oats over here, let me show you. So my mom um, has like this cookie business that she started, and so she gets oats in bulk. So she, Every time I leave her house, I will leave with a giant bag of oats. And here's the deal about those oats. They're really big and they're really like hard to chew. The consistency is just not what I love about oats. And I used to eat this stuff like when I was, when I started my first job, my favorite part of my morning was I would go into the kitchen, pour in my little oatmeal packet heat it up, and then just sit at my desk with like my warm bowl of oatmeal. It was wonderful. And I want that back because it's cold outside and it's gross and I don't, I like eating toast, but I'm starting to get kind of sick of it because I've been eating it every single morning. So we're gonna try something new. I also got, while I was out, this is like possibly a good tip if you really like sweets. Um, I love these lollipops. They're Seize Candies lollipops. I don't know if Seize Candies is everywhere. I think that they're mostly just in the US, but these are like little flavored hard candy lollipops. They have vanilla, butterscotch, cafe latte, and chocolate. My favorite flavor is vanilla, which is probably really boring, but I just like it a lot. And I'll have one of these if I'm like really just needing something sweet, I'll have a lollipop. I love lollipops so much. They're such a joy. Um, I also picked up classic Tales of Horror. This I'm not going to eat. I'm going to read this. So I also got, and this is what I'm super excited about. Okay, Tan Lux. Look at this. This is when I could really use like a legit makeup lighting thing. But this stuff is self-tanning drops. So you put it in your face lotion um, or your body lotion if you're using the body and it'll give you um, a little bit of a tan, like a glow. And the other thing that's awesome about this product that I've been reading about online is that it also has a bunch of other ingredients that are just really, really good for your skin. So not only are you kind of giving yourself a glow, but you're also uh, helping your skin out a lot. So it has quite a few things that are really awesome, like um, raspberry seed oil, aloe, caramel, what? I don't know. Um, I'm not sure what a lot of these are. Some kind of Hexel. You know what? On their website, these are all like the scientific names. I'll show you if it'll focus. I just struggled so hard to try and show you guys the ingredients, but my iPhone just does not want to focus on this. Um, I'll just post it below if you're interested. Um, but I'm really excited because it's my birthday this weekend. <laughs> Yay. 
and I wanted to look really tan. I have this outfit that like shows. Hey, he could it. You are such a spaz. What do we do with you? So much energy. And such a tiny package. Okay, no, not near mommy. Not near mommy. I forget what I was talking about before the dog started barking, but um, I'm gonna try this out and show you a progression of what it does to my face. So stay tuned. Okie dokie, so I just applied that tan luck stuff all over my face and on my body So um, you're supposed to like mix it with moisturizer. So I did that and I have no makeup on It's just that well, I have eye makeup on but not um, face makeup So we'll see what it looks like in about two hours. It's supposed to set so Bella loves the rain. She loves to just like sit at the window and just stare at the rain. It's so cute. You like the rain a lot, do you? Anyways, while we're waiting, I'm just making some matcha tea. Um, it's one of those things I hated the taste of matcha so much uh, until I just started drinking it more. Like it was one of those things that had to grow on me. Uh, and now I like it a lot. So I kind of have one almost every day, especially that little like afternoon coffee that I used to have. It's 2 p.m. I'm not trying to have coffee. Like now is a great time to do tea or something along those lines. Something a little lighter. Coffee makes my mouth taste weird at this point in the day. Well, I'm not crazy about buying expensive things that you only use for one item, but this Breville, it's a milk frother, but you can also make um, tea with it or you can make hot chocolate. You can kind of make whatever you want. This thing is amazing. You literally put it in set it to whatever temperature you want and uh, pop the lid on and it makes the most incredible tea. And it froths up the milk for you. So this is like unsweetened almond milk, very low fat content and it is just amazing. Hopefully I don't spill any. Oh yeah. Get the rest of that. Shout out to Kayla for giving me the freaking best mug ever. Keep it fake, hashtag keep it fake. And the other side says, have an average day. <laughs> I love it. Ella, you wanna go outside? It's just so wet, it's so wet outside. And while we're here, um, I just want to let you guys know the awesome thing about matcha tea is it's super high in antioxidants, so it's really good for you. Um, and it has like the most of this one particular antioxidant, I forget what it's called, but it's like the highest concentration that you can find in a food. So if you are doing the afternoon coffee, get some unsweetened almond milk, get that Breville milk frother, and get some matcha tea and try that out because it is good. Okay, so I'm at the studio. The lighting here is a little better than at home. And I am definitely noticing a little bit more of a bronze going on, um, especially like the glowiness of my skin. Granted, I got a facial yesterday. Um, my like shoulders, I put it on my shoulders. It's really hard to tell because it's very subtle, but I'm kind of into it. Um, there's definitely a glow going on either from the facial or from the tan looks. So yeah, I feel like I'm glad that I bought it. Um, but you know, I tried it on my hand the other day. You can see my hand is like orange and I didn't even notice it being this dark until the next morning. So I have a feeling tomorrow morning will be a little bit more crazy. Yeah. <clears throat> It's currently 8.15. I have not run. I have the option of doing three miles or four miles. I think I'm not running today. <laughs> oh, you okay, Mel? Yeah, I just, uh, I'm just tired and it's late, kinda. I have to be up at five. 
I think I'm just not gonna run. I also taught two classes yesterday, so I feel like it'll be fine. I'm so sorry if you watched this vlog and expected me to run uh, four miles or three miles. This is just one of those days that I just don't, don't wanna do it um, for multiple reasons. Mostly, if I do go and run right now, I will be home at you know 9 p.m. and then I won't be able to fall asleep until probably 10 p.m. That's way too late to be up at 4.30. And on top of all that, I just want to chill, you know? Eat some carrots, drink a little wine, relax. So, thanks for watching today. Oh my gosh, my tan. You can kind of see. Hmm? My friends have told me that I look shiny. Where's good lighting? It's nighttime, so it's really hard to find good lighting anywhere. Um. Melvin might be hawking up a hairball right now. So, I definitely have a glow going on. <laughs> but, um, nothing super crazy or different. Um, let's do a shoulder. Let's check the shoulders. Yeah, pretty much kind of look like how I always look. Dear God, Melvin, are you okay, buddy? Thanks for watching today. Sorry that this was a pointless vlog and sorry that my... Little Bubby's hucking a loogie over here. Jeez, Mel, are you okay, buddy? You okay? Um, subscribe for more videos like this with a vomiting dog. Okay, goodbye. Okay, I finally made it out. It's the next day. I'm doing my distance run today um, because I had such a long break in between. Today I'm doing 12 miles. And I'm halfway through it, a little less than halfway. So I'm taking my goo break and I'm just really bored. I don't feel like running. I wore a tank top because I thought it was gonna be nice out. It's actually really windy, but um, whatever. Gotta keep going. Yay, it's over. Oh my gosh, 12 down. Um, I feel so good. I'm hungry as hell right now, but my body felt great. Like I was definitely done running at the end of that, but I felt really good. She did so good on our three miles. Yes, she did. And now she's so tired. That is the goal. Now I'm going to eat. So uh, yay, 12 down. A million more to go. Okay, see you guys later.